Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem we have the equation f of x which equals 8 to the cx. Now we're looking for the value of f of 3, so when x is equal to 3. But before we do that, we're going to have to find what c is. Luckily, we're given that f of 2 is 1152. So what would that look like? And well, f of 2, 1152, in for f of x, is equal to 8c to the x, and here, x is equal to 2. So 1152 is equal to 8c squared. Now we can solve for c, and then afterwards plug it back in to find f of 3. Okay, so if we divide 8 on both sides, and we're getting c squared on its own is equal to 1152 divided by 8. This is going to be equal to 144. Taking the square root of both sides, we get c is equal to 12. And now that we know c, like I said, we can plug it back in. So we have f of x is equal to 8 times 12 to the x. Now we just have a one variable equation, and we know that we have to plug in 3 for that variable. We can just find f of 3. So f of 3 is going to be 8 times 12 to the 3, plugging in 3 for x. So just doing this out with your calculator, it's going to be 8 times 12 cubed, which is 1728. And 8 times 1728 is going to be 13,824, which is going to be our final answer. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.